I'll be using a low current power supply to simulate a diminished sunlight condition. There is enough voltage to trip the relay, but not enough current to keep the voltage up when the pump first comes on. This situation causes the relay to switch on and off rapidly, resulting in fast chatter. I tried placing large capacitors on the supply voltage without much luck, because when the supply voltage went low, the capacitor lost its charge too fast. Next, I connected a protection diode to the supply voltage on the op amp, but the problem remained. Finally, I realized that a capacitor on the op amp positive rail would do the trick, as long as the protection diode remained. Besides protecting the controller from a reverse voltage mistake, the diode only allows current to flow in one direction. This means that the main discharge path for the capacitor would be through the 200 ohm coil on the relay. The new basic differential controller remains stable under low voltage startup conditions with the help of a capacitor connected to the op amp positive rail protected with a diode. This capacitor solves the controller fast chatter problem of DC powered systems. Now we'll compare actual basic differential controllers with and without positive rail capacitors. Remember, a protection diode must also be connected to the positive rail to prevent reverse current flow. Here we have a basic differential controller without a positive rail capacitor. Let's see what happens when we activate this controller. We're adding heat to the collector thermistor and you can see that the controller is activated. The voltage just went up. That's the voltage that's available to the pump, but the pump's not on. And why the pump is not on? Well, we haven't connected the pump, that's why. If we connect the pump, so just by throwing this switch I'll connect the pump. The uh, voltage drops like a stone. Okay, now with the pump connected, let's see if we can activate the controller. We'll try it again. Add a little heat to the collector thermistor. Okay, and the pump tries to turn on. Now just try it once again and take a look at the, see what happens to the voltage. The voltage went up a little, but that's not very high. It's only 2.8 volts. And what you heard is chatter. That's the pump coming on and off. All right. The green light comes on. And uh, the voltage is over 12 volts when the pump's not connected. But when the pump is connected, the relay is chattering because the pump pulled down the voltage to the relay coil. When the pump is off, the voltage rises and the voltage and the cycle repeats. Fast chatter essentially destroys the contacts on the relay, so it should be avoided. All right, now let's get a controller with the positive rail capacitor in place. Now let's take a look we'll what, how, at the new basic differential controller. It's identical to the old one in every way except for one. It has a 10 microfarad capacitor. See it right here? That's a 10 microfarad capacitor and that's connected to the positive rail input of the op amp. And that's used to keep the voltage up when the pump comes on. All right, right now the pump is turned off. Let's see what happens when we activate the controller, we'll add heat to the collector thermistor. There, the green light came on. And you can see the voltage is 12.3 volts, the same as it was before on the other controller. <coughs> now, we're going to see what how it responds if we turn the pump on. Okay, the voltage dropped. It came off. But now let's activate the controller. 
Ready? Okay. Here we go. All right. Now there, you notice there's no chatter. The pump came on and everything's running smoothly. And it just went off. And the reason it went off is because the uh, the probe cooled off. Let's add a little heat again. All right, we get it nice and hot. So it'll stay on for a little while. And the length of time that it stays on, that can be adjusted with the differential adjustment. Okay, you can see the output voltage is 7.78 volts, and that's enough to keep the pump flowing. Uh, normally, you're going to want a voltage closer to 12 volts, uh, but uh, if it works at a minimum voltage, you know it'll work at a higher voltage. Anyway, this is the new improved basic differential controller. The chatter problem has been eliminated, the voltage available to the pump is high, and the pump is turning smoothly. Now it just came off. Now see this can be adjusted. This is the differential pot adjustment. If we turn it totally counterclockwise, we can turn the pump on. If we turn it the other way, the pump comes off and it takes more heat to activate the pump. And that red light, which we'll talk about in the next video, that indicates the amount of heat that's available. So the more heat I add to the probe, the hotter it gets. Eventually it should come on there. It comes on at a very high temperature. That's a differential temperature of maybe 40 degrees, 30, 40 degrees, something like that. But you notice it doesn't stay on very long because that cools down pretty quickly. Okay, anyway, uh, this is uh, the basic problem that I wanted to uh, talk about with this uh, chatter control. And it looks like we've solved the problem of uh, fast chatter. Anyway, thank you very much for your time. May every day be a good solar day. Okay, be good. Okay, this is our new basic differential controller with the capacitor attached to the positive rail of the op amp input. Okay, we're going to turn it on now. Uh, basically what I'm doing is I'm adjusting the differential so that it comes on at a very low differential. See it came right up, pump is on, nice and smooth, no chatter. So, take out the papers and the trash, or you don't get no spending cash, if you don't scrub that kitchen floor, you ain't gonna rock and roll no more, yaggedy yak, don't talk back, just finish cleaning up your room, let's see that dust fly with that broom, get all that garbage out of sight. Oh, you don't go out Friday night, yaggedy yak. Don't talk back. You just put on your coat and hat and walk yourself to the laundry mat. And when you finish doing that, bring in the dog and put out your cat, yaggedy yak. Don't talk back. Don't talk back. Yaggity yag, yaggity yag.